before now, I've been smoking cannabis, all kind of smoke you can think of, clubs, and honestly, if looking at my past, most time when I go through my pictures, I'll be like, wow, is this me? This your story is mind blowing. From the streets, sleeping on the street, best streets, to being a director of a photo studio that is going global. The video you're about to watch is a transformational story that was brought about only by the help of the Holy Spirit using men that are available. Yes. Yeah. Good day, have a word, and you're most welcome to Central's blog and Central Foundation. And to all of us at the Central Foundation, this is the happiest day ever. Remember, like three months down the line, uh, or almost going to four months right now, because today is the 15th of July, 2023, precisely the 20th of March, 2023, we picked this young man, Ernest. Yes, from the streets, from one of the streets of Lagos. And he was just sleeping on the streets of Lagos, needed help from the foundation. And the rest now is history. You can see standing by me here is his wonderful yeah. pastor that met him as in... Actually, the pastor discovered this young boy and uh, he looked at the situation of this young boy. Instead of just preaching Jesus Christ on an empty belly, he decided to say, I'm going to preach Jesus, but I also have something that is better that can make your life worth living so that this young man can be socially responsible and be worldly because ability to take care of yourself spiritually backed up with ability to take care of yourself financially we prevent you from going into what we call fraudulent with rootus and all the social biases and being used by the one percent of the world to work against us so, so he decided to say i preach jesus christ to you you know what i know a foundation that will help me to take care of your what your financial aspect by training you on how to catch the fish not to beg for the fish by being trained in career of your choice i think i would like the pastor to tell us how it come about this in just few minutes okay praise god hallelujah yeah. okay um by god's grace um i and my wife we decided to go on street evangelism to fish out for souls, just like the Lord commanded us. So we decided to do that, and we were just going around and shared flyers, preached to some uh, to some persons, and the Holy Spirit touched him. So he was the first to actually even come and say that God, um, he was led to come join the, the ministry, Excelling Life Gospel Church, Lagos Branch. So after he came, some others were, were, were coming. So seeing him, we saw the passion in him, we saw the drive for God's work and and the kingdom. So we decided to, uh, more than this, just coming to church and you still staying on the street, there, there's more to life. Okay, there's more to life. It can be better than this, spiritually, economically, socially, otherwise. So um, I've known um, the Central Foundation for a while. So I was like, ah, yes, there, there can be a good link here. So I met him and Graciously, he, with open arms, I was so surprised. He just accepted me, accepted him, and brought him into the foundation. And just like in speed of light, it was just I was most times I was surprised that ah, uh, ah, uh, yes, from here, ah, uh, uh, you you now do this, ah, uh, uh, they are send you to go and take um, pictures, pictures uh, on your, your own events. I was later surprised when they said you. Not in a location for him to do the work. Wow, that was that was just mind blowing. That was amazing. So I want to bless God for the life of my dear uh, brother and the foundation, Central Foundation. It's what it's, it's 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 a great thing that the Lord is using them to do in this generation. So it's not just about bringing people um, to Christ, but Jesus. If you look at what Je what Jesus even did. He said, these people have been with us for a while. I've been teaching them the word. They need to eat. He said, look for food. For them to eat. Them yes. Jesus had to take care of them. So that is what Central Foundation is all about. All ramification 
looking at the well-being of individuals and I pray that God will strengthen them in Jesus' name. Amen. What do you have to say? Hello everyone. My name is Dennis Alino. I was a young boy at Central Swanation Creek from the street of Lagos three months ago for a training of photography on three, three what? Three months. Okay, three months. Three months for videography and photography and videography. So here we are. I'm really excited for this day. I want to thank God for everything. Firstly, I want to thank the Central Foundation. I want to thank the committee members. I want to thank all the partners, people that are making sure that the foundation is moving. I really want to thank God. I want to thank everybody. I also I want to thank the Cetro's family. I want to thank my boss, Mr. Cetro. I want to thank his wife also. They have been good to me. And also my pastor, they all made this possible. And I'm so grateful for this opportunity. I'm really grateful, honestly. Thank you, everyone. Welcome. So, Ernest right now is the director of the first franchise ever wow. of the Cetrus Foundation, wow. and this is called Cetrus Focus Space. Then, then, Kai, catch it. <laughs> <laughs> you can see, you can see the student, the student that is going to remind him is going to be as a. I'm so happy that we could achieve this within yes. the shortest span of time, and we pray that God will grant you the wisdom, the knowledge to manage this place perfectly well so that we can be encouraged to do more, do more for other youths that will be coming because this your story is mind-blowing from the streets sleeping on the street best streets to being a director of a photo studio that is going global mm. we want to say thank you to all our partners yeah. all our community our members our investor mm -hmm. Because we love you and we want to say thank you, sir, yeah. for doing your own part because you should have told us of your other life, as in it was really a street guy. Mm. So, and there's nobody without being changed that way that will be able no, to. No, 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 tell us a little bit about, about your street, street guy. Do you, what do you take? Do you smoke this? Do you do? <laughs> tell okay. us. Okay, uh, a quick one. So, before now, before I came to Lagos, you know, just summarize it. What do you think? Just okay. tell us the bad things you planned. Okay. We know before that now, God can change everybody. Before now, I've been into some bad vices. You no know, smoking, you can think of any bad Just, life. just stop it. Hey, 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 hey. Smoking, what do you smoke? Talking, is it? You, That's okay. this talk. It's your past. past. Yes, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. It's your okay. past. Okay, so before now, I've been smoking cannabis. All kind of smoke, you can think of drugs, and honestly, if looking at my past, most time when I go through my pictures, I'll be like, Why wow, is this me? I can't believe that. Because, meanwhile, before coming to Lagos, I was already exposed to, to, to life. So, coming to Lagos really affected me negatively. It had a positive impact in me. Even when I call my mom on the phone, because she be like, you need to stop this thing. This, this thing is affecting you. Because it's only your mom that will tell you that this thing, because they are very spiritual. So each time I call her on the phone, when I tell her that, ah, like mom, for seriously, I have stopped smoking. And most times she calls my, I think she calls my pastor. She has my pastor number. So she herself, she has noticed that, yeah, this, my son has changed. Meanwhile, before now, with the distance self, even looking at when we are, when I was from Delta State, from Warri to really coming to her place, when, you know, when she sees me, she'll be like, ah, this guy, but with the distance self, she knows that she has rest of mind that, ah, this guy, I think it's can you see a good part of life. Can you, so can you see? Grateful because um, my past is nothing to write yeah. about the old man like, is gone but, but, but okay. this new me i'm really grateful no worry, no worry. So there's a lot more to say i think that will be a part two yes, yes. he's yes. going to tell us this side of life so that you that are yes, that yes. they can see how yes. life can be transformed and that is why i want to see your success in this economy in this uh, uh, environment that we are just giving to you want people to see your story and to learn so that others can stop the vices 
we need to go now because something is about to be cooked. <laughs> so thank you so very much. So if you are still out there and you have youths like this that we can reach out to, they yeah. are great. And if you see what he's been doing now, if you see his work, yeah. you will not say this is this guy that was picked some months back. So if you have yeah. youths out there that are looking up to such opportunities, they must be diligent. So if they are indigent but diligent, Central Foundation is out for them and together we're going to change this world. Thank you so very much. Catch you. Bye. 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 So you've seen the transformational story of Hennest just on the four months by the Holy Spirit and using available men. And now we have lots of youths that have been trained by the Centrus Foundation and they are now done with the training in their craft. All they are waiting for is for them to be established in various or numerous businesses they've led, craft they've led. And if you're there, you are a passionate person about helping to grow and groom the African youth into utmost productivity, then please, you can reach out to us because we're looking for willing investors that can invest into their businesses just like some persons that have done for earnest with the help of Central Foundation. So kindly reach out to us. We have various crafts, categories, sectors available for those that want to invest into those youths. So reach out to us on the number showing below and don't forget, send us the youths that needs to be trained and taken away from the streets. And please do be a part of this success story of transforming the lives of the African youths. Thank you so very much to all that have been there for us. I want to say thank you so very much everyone out there. Please don't forget to like, share, subscribe and help us with even though it's a dollar, two dollars, whatever you have. And please don't forget to like, share and subscribe and please support the foundation through all our payment platforms that are shown below. Thank you. Catch you. Love you. Bye. -bye.